So I'm a gay man. Gay. Gay. Queer. Whatever you want to call me. I am gay. And I love pretty much everything gay. Pretty much everything gay. Pretty much everything queer. With the exception of this one thing. And it drives me bonkers. Yes, Super Rave friends, I'm Joe Karlovsky, the Super Rave teacher on a mission to tip the world and YouTube in a radically positive and accepting way for all LGBTQ plus teachers, students, and folk, one click at a time, shifting the momentum, shifting the narrative in favor of all LGBTQ plus people. So what could be that one thing that drives me, Joe Karlovsky, bonkers, and it's gay. Hmm. Hmm. What could it be? Gay t-shirts? Nope. There's no such thing. Um, books with gay characters? Nope. Movies with gay characters? Nope. Gay people in general? Nope. Even gay stereotypes don't drive me as bonkers as this one thing. Can you guess what it is? I'll give you a hint. It's somewhat related to the reason I am the Super A teacher. It's somewhat related to why I'm on a mission to dip the world, YouTube, and Google in a radically positive and accepting way. Can you guess? Hmm. It goes something like this. Gay things, lesbian things, transgender things, queer things are constantly tabbed as mature content or warning before anything happens. So let me give you an example. You watch a movie like The Notebook, one of the straightest movies that there could be in the history of life, right? Guy meets girl, falls in love, there's even a little nudity. Is there a warning for that? Nope. That's PG-13. PG-13. However, you have a movie with gay characters, lesbian characters, transgender characters, and there's a kiss. There's any interest of them being a full human being. And you have to have mature content or some type of content warning. When did people, people like me, turn into a content warning for just being who we are? For just being who we are. It'd be one thing if it was standard across every movie, but it's not across every video, but it's not. People hear, people still hear words like gay, lesbian, transgender, bisexual, queer, all of these words, and they're like, oh, be careful. What if, what if the kids would find out that there's gay people in the world? They'd be just fine because it starts with you adults. It starts with you, anybody who's willing to say, enough, these are real awesome human beings and they are not content warnings. They are not just for mature audiences. I am a kindergarten teacher. I'm a damn good kindergarten teacher. I'm one of the best there is. And no family, no child needs a content warning with me because A, I'm awesome, and B, I'm a professional. I'm a professional, okay? So I'm sharing that because I want you to think of real people whenever you start a show or a program or a video or a movie and you're like, ooh, why does it say mature content or content warning? Just because there happens to be gay people in it? Queer people, transgender, lesbians? No. And it's not okay. Let's stand up and continue to stand up and fight for people and say, no, that is not okay. We need to shift the narrative today. We need to make it better today, little by little, by raising awareness of it and saying, nope, nope, nope. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for taking someone like me seriously enough to say, hmm, I'm at least going to think about that. And I'm going to make a decision what I do about that. I'm not telling you what to do. I just want you to think about it. And I'm going to end this video like I end all videos. You are awesome. You are enough. 
just for being who you are. And Joel, maybe there should be a sass warning, but not a content warning on who you are. Joel, you're enough. Bye, friends. Checking out